What's up everybody, Tony here with High Tech Check, and today we're going to be taking a look at Poetics case lineup for the iPhone 13 Pro Max. I will also be putting links in the description in case you guys want to pick up these cases yourself. And if you guys like me and you want to support my channel, please use those links because it helps me keep purchasing products to do reviews for you guys. So let's go ahead and start with the unboxing. Okay, so let's start off with the Poetic Lumo case. This is a totally clear case. It's got rubber, edge, rubber edges with a nice hard backing. Very nice. I also do have a screen protector on here. So in case you're wondering how the case does with a screen protector, it seems to work pretty well. It is also a full coverage screen protector. The case does have a nice raised edge around the front. It's got your cutouts for the volume buttons here separated with your mute button, your cutouts for your charging port, mic, and speaker. Got your power button on the side here. It also does have a nice raised bump around the camera to protect that. Nice and clear to show off the color of your phone. It does pick up fingerprints. Uh, but you can't see them very well, especially on the white here. You can just wipe them off. It is grippy, so you don't have to worry about it slipping out of your hand. The buttons are very clicky and responsive, work really well. And if you're wondering if this works with wireless charging, there you go. No problems there. And again, this is the Lumos case. It is pretty nice. So if you wanna show off your phone, this is the case for you. Next up is the Neon. And if it comes in a case like this, pretty neat. Uh, if you want to open it up, you just kind of press in uh, on the sides here and kind of just rip it open. <laughs> it's got the little cutouts for that, pretty cool. Nice presentation, and it just slides out like that. And there's the case on the inside. This looks like a really nice case. All right, so we have our orange accent on the back side here. It's got some rubber pieces here, hard plastic on the back. This does look like it is a two-piece design with an inner rubber uh, cover and a hard outer shell. So you just peel this out and then you put your iPhone inside the rubber portion. Fits on there really well. And then all you need to do is take the hard case and just press it onto the back just like that. Very nice. So as you can see, it does have the reinforced edges in case you happen to drop your phone. It does have a raised edge around the front of the phone. On the sides here we have our separated volume buttons with the cutout for the mute button. On the bottom you have all your cutouts there and the power button on the side. And the edges are rubber too to protect your phone. On the back we do have the camera recessed so it is covered and it's got that nice orange accent which is cool like I said. And then it's got these rubber pieces on the side surrounded by a hard back. Buttons are clicky. Press in very nice. They are kind of almost flush. They just stick out very barely. I kind of like them to stick out a little more, but you can still easily press the power button. And it doesn't add too much bulk to the phone, just a little bit for that extra protection. It does feel very sturdy. I definitely think uh, the phone would be uh, protected in case you dropped it. And if you're wondering if this works with wireless charging, no issues there. I like how it makes your phone flat. So no matter where you press on the phone, it doesn't rock at all. Next up, we have their Guardian case. Now, the one thing that I absolutely love that Poetic does is they give you two inner lining pieces. One, if you have your own glass screen protector, like I do, you can use this inner portion that doesn't have anything in it. Or if you don't have a protection for your phone, they also include the one with the plastic screen protector on it. I love it. So I'm going to use the one 
that doesn't include the screen protector because I already have my Sapphire screen protector on it. You just kind of press it over the phone and then we'll go ahead and press this into the outer portion. Very nice. So it's got that awesome protection for around the front of your phone. So you don't have to worry about anything touching the screen. It's got some really reinforced edges here that are all rubber in case you happen to drop your phone. You got your volume buttons here separated, your cover for your mute button, keep that nice. You have your cover for your charging port, and then your power button on the side. On the back, it's got a nice clear case. Again, there is a raised edge around the camera to help keep that protected. Very nice. Shows off the color of your phone really well. You can really see those reinforced edges too. So this will definitely have you covered in case you happen to drop your phone. Buttons are clicky, easily accessible, no issues there. And if you're wondering if this works with wireless charging, no issues there either. I will also tell you if you use the one with the built-in screen protector, there are not any issues with touch. I've actually tried this with over my Sapphire screen protector and it still works. So uh, this does definitely give you protection as well as allow you to use your, your touch without any issues. And then just to show you that the touch does work just fine even over my Sapphire screen protector. I'm going to go ahead and put it on my phone and I'll show you how the touch still works. So here we have the screen protector over my Sapphire screen protector. So here is the cover with the screen protector built in. As you can see it's got the cutouts for your sensors at the top and there are no touch issues. So you definitely don't have to worry about that. And then here we have their Revolution case. This is again is also a two-piece design. It also comes with one case one topper that has a built-in screen protector and one that does not in case you want to use your own. This particular one has its own kickstand, which is really cool. So again, make sure that your phone face is clean before you put on the one with the screen protector on it. I'll go ahead and push this over the top and then we'll push it into the outer portion of the case. All right, so here we have the phone in the case. The edges, again, are really reinforced in case you happen to drop your phone. It is grippy. It's not gonna slip out of your hand. Again, it's got that nice raised edge around the front here to protect your phone. It adds a little bit more bulk to the phone because of that stand on the back, but it's still not really that thick. Here you have your volume buttons, your little cover for your mute button. Here we have on the bottom the cover for your charging port, those reinforced edge, edges as you can see. On the back, again, it's got that kickstand in case you want to watch something in landscape mode or even in portrait. Easily goes back down. You also have the raised edge around the camera for protection there. Nice hard back. And if you're wondering if this works with wireless charging, no issues there. And that is the Guardian. So that is Poetic's case lineup for the iPhone 13 Pro Max. Again, if you guys want to pick these up, I will be putting a link in the description. And if you guys like me and you want to support my channel, please use those links because it helps me keep purchasing products and reviews for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification bell to let you guys know when I put out new videos. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next one. Later.